have some tulips who are on their way out. So we're going to take a look at their um, reproductive structures. Okay, so this guy here has some beautiful petals, okay, which we're going to peel back to reveal okay, our reproductive structures, specifically the stigma and the anther. So this entire female part here is called the pistil, okay, and this male part, oops, sorry, you can't see, let me try that again. Okay, so right here, this piece is the stamen, that's the male part of the plant. Okay, this piece here is the pistil. Okay, so let's go through the male piece just for a minute here. Good job, honey. Okay, so right here, we have the filament. Okay, so the filament is the piece that holds up the anther. This piece is the anther. Okay, and all over my fingers, you can see that we have the yellow pollen. Okay, this is what sticks to our bees and our pollinators and eventually gets transferred to the pistil of another plant. So we want the stigma to capture that pollen. Okay, and it's going to grow a pollen tube down inside until it reaches the ovule. Okay, and it's gonna fertilize the ovum inside, the egg cells. So if we open this up, Okay, we don't see any fertilization that's taken place in this particular sample. Okay, but typically, and if this was a fruit, okay, this ovary would swell up and produce fruit. There you go.